Hello everyone. Today we're looking at the 2021 Tesla Model 3 Premium. The Model 3 is the least expensive Tesla you can buy, but the one we're looking at today has added features. Now let's go ahead and check out the exterior and talk about some of the specs. Press this button right here and the door will open. The exterior color we're looking at today is known as Midnight Silver Metallic and you do have 19 inch alloy wheels. This one does have the dual motor. This Model 3 does have a EPA estimated range of 353 miles. The top speed is 145 miles an hour and it has 0 to 60 in 4.2 seconds. This one also has the autopilot package, which is an extra $8,000. The MSRP is $33,000. With the autopilot package, it brings it to $41,000. And with all the other packages that, that this Model 3 has, it brings it up to $57,490. Now let's go ahead and check out the interior. Press right here, and the vehicle will open door will open for you door panels right here lots of leather and some alcantara inside you do have a black leather interior your steering wheel right here three spoke leather wrapped steering wheel with only two controls to interact with the infotainment system. The leather is very soft. Now let's go ahead and check out the infotainment system. Here it displays all the charging stations in the US as well as some portions of Canada. Quick controls right here, press on the car button, lighting controls, lock, display, driving, autopilot, navigation, safety and security, service. This is the Model 3 and it does have 16,628 miles on it. I could also name the vehicle, but I'm not going to do that. All your radio stations right here you can also type the radio station with this keypad phone right here as well as streaming spotify Karaoke, you can control the bass, the mid and the treble right here on the audio settings. Press right here, and you also can call people. You have to connect a phone via Bluetooth. Press here again, and you can view your calendar. Again, you have to connect your phone to the infotainment system. And here are your cameras. As you can see, you can see this Tesla that's behind me. And more angles of the camera. This one does have a total of four cameras. Here you can see another Tesla and a Tesla that's right next to me. All 
all your energy statistics right here. Consumption. It does have 57% of battery left. Web right here. Arcade. All the you can play all these games. Toy box right here. You can play around with this. And here you can control the AC. Like in normal cars, you don't have you have air vents, but in this car, you actually control where the AC blows with the infotainment system, which is pretty cool. It can also put in dog mode and camp mode. This have dual zone climate control. Your defogger right here. Three stage heated seats for the driver and the front passenger. A cubby space right here. And another cubby space right here, which is really deep. I was closing the lid way too harshly. And then the infotainment system told me to close the console gently, which is a pretty cool feature. Two cup holders, as well as a leather stitch and leather covered center console, fully adjustable with a piece right here to store some small items. And again, it is very deep with a 12 volt power outlet. Let's put this piece back. Trim right here. You do not get a gl glove box with this one. A standard rear view mirror. I wish they would have put garage door settings. Your hazards right here. There is plenty of space back here. Two pockets on the driver and passenger side seat. Very soft plastic with two air vents and two USB ports, as well as a leather covered armrest that has two cup holders. Your lighting controls right here. Your glass roof. One right here in the front. And there's another one here in the back. And here's what it looks like from the rear seats. Now let's go ahead and check out the rear cargo space. Press right here. And I did expect a power lift gate actually, especially at this price point. All weather floor mats for the cargo space. Some type of circular pattern right here. There's lots of space back here. You can fit plenty of items. Let's go ahead and close this. It is a little bit he heavy. And that concludes the review of the 2021 
Tesla Model 3 Premium. Thank you so much for watching this video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and leave your car view suggestions in the comments below. Goodbye!